Yo, what's up, Steve? Number one here today, sir. Thank you so much, man. Hi. Welcome, welcome. Hello. This was literally on a whim. I didn't know what I was playing today, guys, but uh, here I am. It was like, I haven't played this in a hot minute. Everyone always plays X2, 1, and 4, never 3. So here I am playing 3. Because, uh, why not? Arguably, 3 is probably the weakest on the, on the Super Nintendo. What's up, Jason? Kyle, Casey, John, Freddy, Mrs. Blast. I never call her that. I call her Queen. Uh, Sam is here. Steve was the first one in line. Let's go. X3 is I. What's up, Darren? <laughs> X3 is pretty good. It is the weakest of the original trilogy, though. So I'll give you that. Four day weekend. All volumes are low. You know, volumes are low. Um. Oh. Is that better? Wow, why was X3 so quiet? That's weird. What's up, Brady? Thanks for the likes, man. Eh, good man, X3. X3 is the best of all time, says Justin. What's up, Nick? Careful saying it's the weakest to Joshi. Hola, senor. Is that better? Have you turned up all the way on the phone? Is that better? Because every time I play a game, you're always like, it's too loud. So... I don't get why X3 gets a bad rap. I like it. I don't, you know, honestly, I think it's because people are mad that they can't own it. Because it's so expensive. Is that better, Mrs. Blast? Is it better? Thank you, John. Appreciate the like, man. Four day weekend and coming for some people here. Don't have to go to work all weekend volume as lupe is napping and i'm not waking her up yo what's up tim please don't wake up the baby is that better guys is it loud enough now it's loud in my ears jeebus thank you rubies appreciate the double likes oh he can't, he takes a lot more hits than i forgot thank you kyle appreciate the like you ever play metroid i do sometimes um actually friday night i'll be playing metroid we're going to continue with uh, Metroid Fusion. Turn your volume up. What do you mean, turn my volume up? Like, my microphone? Or the game? Which Metroid? Metroid Fusion. <clears throat> hey, Walter, what's up, man? Why well, was actually the weakest entry? I don't know. For me, I don't know. I just felt like... Thank you, Brady, for the 151 stars, man. Um, I don't know. I just felt like it didn't really bring anything new to the table. I don't know. That's just me, though. Turn down for what? Can you hear the game? Great. Yeah, so I don't know what Mrs. Blast is talking about. Maybe your phone speakers are messed up. Thank you, Queen, for the likes. My microphone volume is the same as it was yesterday. Drew has a question. What's your question, sir? Hey, Marshy, what's up, man? Hope you're doing okay today, dude. All right. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Okay, yeah, I don't understand why she's telling me to turn up the volume and mess with it. What's up, Mike? Could be. Plenty loud on my end, trust me. So is it zero hack? Yes and no. Uh, the modders created this to where you can use zero throughout the entire game if you want. What's up, Brian? How'd you get to be so good looking? And one day, could I be as good looking as you? Um, yes. Uh, I don't know about the good looking part on for me while wow, zero fell in the hole right there. Um, but yeah, you can definitely try if you want. What's up, Eric? Casey has a question. You guys have a lot of questions today. So you can tell how many times I beat this game. At least on this file alone. Okay, so with that one. Oh, we even have a plain one right there. Plain Jane. Let's go. What's up, Gil? You sound lower than the game and my phone is at like 90%. I... I don't know what to tell you, Mrs. Blast. My volume stuff is the same as yesterday. I don't get it either. And my microphone is positioned perfectly. So. What's up, Gil? How's it going, man? Hey, Kirk. What's up, dude? Castlevania? 
I my Castlevania skills are super lacking. I don't really mess with that one. This is a blast. I don't know what to tell you. My uh what's up, E? How's it going, dude? Just trying to get through this part. I really should be zero right now. But hold up. Let me uh Wow, you punks. I don't know, man. I've been trying to play Castlevania good my entire life, and I just never... I don't know. It's just one of those games in my life that I just never got good at. I tried. Sounds fine. Sounds good. Do you follow weakness just random? Uh, so usually I start with this guy first. Just so I can get the leg upgrade. That's how I do it, so... Blizzard Buffalo Wings. Little did everyone know that while he was detained, X was subjected uh, to invasive probing a slime sigma to finally infect him with the virus. X's resistance kept him normal until centuries later, Mega Man Zero, where he became corrupted X. Wasn't he a clone? I think he was a clone, wasn't he? I don't know. I think he was a clone. Kelly, welcome to the stream. Oh, I know the Muffin Man. Yes, I have a muffin actually in the kitchen. I want to eat it, but you know. Uh, let's see here. Simon's Quest is the only one I'm good at. That's actually not a bad thing to say, though, considering Simon's Quest is, like, definitely considered one of the more difficult games. It's very cryptic. You don't know what you're doing. Oh, my God. Almost died right there. Slow down. Jeez, Breddy, thank you for the stars, a-hole. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate the star love, dude. Isn't that cool seeing your name right there? Damn. What's up, Brandon? I'm not seeing some comments. Chat being meh. Ugh. I'm actually really happy I was even able to go live today, guys. <laughs> because uh, apparently uh, there are some creators, I am the even big streamers, that could not use the go live feature today. There was a bug going around saying they were temporarily blocked from live streaming. And they don't even know why or how. So there's that. What's up, Jeff? It's, uh, what kind of muffin is that? I think the one that's left is a, some type of, I don't know what kind it is. It's really good. What's up, Shayna? Yo, Duke, what's up, my dude? Don't forget, sir, your game is being played later this evening. You can give this to uh, X, by the way. Equivalent to the Adventure of Link, it's not bad, just kind of eh. Wait, really? Wait, really what? Thank you so much for the like, sir. Appreciate it, man. So, subscribers, uh, don't forget tonight's stream is uh, Star Fox and uh, give us some butthead for the Super Nintendo. Oh my god, I don't know why I just did that. Jeebus Louibus. Let me give uh, X this health right here. Leaving work, yay! So we got those two wacky games tonight and... Oh, I forgot. I already got the, uh, the sub tank. I don't need this. God. Thank you. I'm in the shower and my dogs were just barking. Bark I'm like, what the hell are they barking at? So, of course, by the time I get out of the shower to go check what's going on, it's all the ruckus. And uh, it's gone. And I'm pretty sure it was one of the neighbors walking their dog. So, you know. Slide right and then slide back left. Oh. <laughs> okay, Bavis. <laughs> you know, um... I wouldn't mind playing Castlevania 2 if I got to play a ROM-fixed version of it, which I know there's plenty of them out there, so. Day off. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jesus. Yes, they nerfed the crap out of the Z-Saber, guys, so you can't just beat Mavericks to a bloody pulp with two hits on this thing. So... You gotta do it the right way. The right way. Day off is always good. AKA, uh, it is 92 degrees outside, so I'm very happy I don't have a job where I work outside. Ah, oh, no! Damn it. How hot is it where you guys are? Or cold, for that matter. Some of you guys got hit with some pretty nasty storms yesterday, so... Is that too? She barks at people walking their dog? Yeah, it's insane, dude. Oh, God. I mean, I'm used to it. I just hate when they do it when I cannot stop them from doing it. This is also the time of day where my dogs get very antsy because uh, Mrs. Blast will be home soon. Peace. Scout, it's 65, it's 85, it's 91. Mackie, you and I have like the same weather. 
take him out. Bam! Don't know. Been inside all day. Sir, you're in front of your computer. You should know what the temperature is. Sam. She's hearing me at the moment. Good. Good doggy. Uh, she's Mimi's. Good. Well, mine is pretending that she's Mimi's right now. Yeah, she's just licking her paws now, acting like she's all innocent. But we all know when they're doing that, they're ready to bark and scream at something else that they saw outside. So that's what doggies do. But we still love them to death, so. 58? Yeah, that's perfect, dude. I'll trade you. What's up, Billy? It is currently 92 degrees here, and it says mostly sunny. Good water. All right, so now we're going to switch it over to X, and we do, yes. Um, yeah, this one I do a particular order most times. Um, it's just much easier to beat these guys in the order that they're supposed to. Some people start with a different Maverick. They usually start with Buffalo. So. so other than work, what did you guys get into today? Please tell me it was something interesting. Don't give me no sussy nonsense. Yeah, see, 70 is good too, man. It's weird because the humidity's not very high here. Uh, it's just really, really, really warm today. Not dog person, but that doesn't mean I don't like them. I just prefer having cats. It's okay. I wouldn't mind having a cat, though. Um, but she's really, really allergic to them. So, what's up, Chris? Did I say pineapple goes on pizza? I think you did yesterday? I want to say you did yesterday. Finally beat Persona 5. Nice. I made a little more progress today in Resident Evil 4. I think the next major part is going to be where I fight Krauser for the second time. So finally got past a lot of the regenerators. I did the mission where uh, the merchant wants you to take out the, the Iron Maiden, the incubation lab. Hey, that was a pain in the ass. Two cats. Customer going in Wawa saw me and make a joke saying it is summer. Did I miss something? Well, it is really hot today. At least here it is. So, I mean, there's... Maybe it is summer. <laughs> cats are spawn of Satan. I spent my day moving lots of TVs around to put two new ones out, all of them moving to most of my shift. That's good, though. Didn't really have to work with customers that much, right? That's cool. Like I said, I don't mind cats. It's just um, Princess doesn't like them at all. And Mrs. Blast can't be around them. She's extremely, extremely allergic to the dander. <clears throat> so, no bueno for us. What's up, Patron? Plax, NFL, NES, RBI Baseball 3, and Pac-Man, the Tengen version. Very nice. What's up, Thomas? Could use zero here and take this guy out a lot faster, but zero makes the game a little more difficult later on down the line because he doesn't get armor upgrades like X does. How's it going, buddy? It's good, man. We had one, but gave it to a friend of ours. Cat kept pissing at the baby. Oh, no, no, no. We can't have that. What's up, Joey? Can't have a second cat. My cat's very territorial. Mm -hmm. We tried to get a third dog a couple years ago. Abby, thank you for the likes. Um, uh, Snoopy was very protective of Princess, and uh, the other dog, all he wanted to do was dominate and be the alpha. And Snoopy's like, hell no, get out of my house. So that same day we got the dog home and we thought we'd be able to keep him, we had to take him back because he was not getting along with our two established pupperoos. So, you're not bad, I'm just a dog person. Yeah, I would definitely say I'm more of a dog person than a cat person. Although, I do love all animals, so I'm totally... I'm down with that. Let's go hit him with the blue ice. So tonight, guys, like I said, for the supporter stream, we have um, Star Fox and Beavis and Butthead. Both, of course, both for the Super Nintendo. And then tomorrow... For the, the public stream, uh, I'm not sure yet, but Friday, tomorrow night, we're going to be playing Metroid Fusion, so that'll be cool on the VIP stream. Saturday, um, I actually forget where we're, we're playing. 
Sunday, I forgot. Well, I think Saturday is Zelda. Maybe Sunday is too. I don't know. Um, Sunday night, we're going to play that everyone or golf with everyone. I can't remember the name of it. With supporters as well on the VIP stream. So. Uh, I love both equally. I'm a shark advocate. Well, I'm sure if you could keep a shark as a pet, Brady, you'd probably do that, right? Although that'd be dangerous at the same time. I mean, they are wild animals. Like, you can't. Just be like, oh, I have a pet shark in my bathtub. <laughs> John says, you got it. Sweet. I can never remember the damn name of it. <laughs> Let me read off that schedule. Hold up. It's rare that I have a schedule of what I'm supposed to play. Golf with everyone. Is that what it's called? Golf with your friends. Jesus. <laughs> I was way off. Okay, so yeah, tonight is Star Fox and Beeps and Butthead. Tomorrow night is Metroid Fusion. Saturday is Mega Man X4. Um, Tuesday, April 11th is X-Men for the Genesis. Link to the Past is Friday, April the 14th. Saturday, April 15th is Beautiful Joe 2 for the GameCube. Sunday, April 16th is Ocarina of Time. And then uh, Thursday, April 20th is any Kirby game of my choosing. I think one of the newer ones, probably. Laser beams hatch the friggin' heads. They have lasers attached to the heads? <laughs> Having sharks in a tank shortens their lifespan. Oh, having any animal in captivity would do that. With all this controversy I'm seeing about, I don't know, some e world type of place letting a, uh, a killer whale out into the wild after being in captivity for like 50 years. That's no bueno. That thing will not survive in the wild. So, but that's a conversation for another day. That's a conversation for a subscriber stream. Okay, so, um... Now we go after the rhino. It's simple. We kill the rhino. The King Kirby game just asked. Yeah, I'm thinking about... Since I haven't played that much of it, maybe Kirby and the Forgotten Land. I'll use the uh, Yuzu. I have that for Yuzu, I think. If not, I'll play it on my Switch. No big deal. I think I have it on Yuzu. I have to double check. I've heard it plays perfectly on Yuzu. And look... The text goes faster. You can swap back and forth as many times as you want between X and zero. You're not just limited. To just one chance. What's up, Kyle? These little guys suck, though. My second favorite Kirby game? Wait, what's the first one? Yeah, there you go. Oh, come on, dude. I'm trying to jump and get him, but he wouldn't let me. Yeah, I can't get that yet. Bum, bum, bum. Oh my god, that was that was scary. <laughs> this AO uh this AOA1 is dope, bro. Better than the Steam Deck? Wait, really? I heard uh Asus has got a um their own version of the Steam Deck now. Apparently people are liking that even better. I would love to have one of those handheld PCs, but man, they're expensive. I can't, it, like, okay, so for me personally, if I'm gonna throw like $900 at a computer like that, I would literally throw that at my gaming PC that I have now. Oh, shoot, I gotta fight this guy. Planet Robobot, where Kirby's giant mech. Oh, that's right. What's up, Leonard? Hope all's well with you, Mrs. Blast. is wonderful today, sir. How's your evening? I forgot about Robobot. Does it, um... I don't know if they fixed the emulation with it. I doubt it. I'd love to play it on 3DS, but... I mean, I could, technically. I'd have to do, like, an old-school caveman stream pointing my camera at my 3DS. It doesn't play that great, I think, on Citra. Look at this guy. Little punk. Ugh! Oh, I got him. Woof, that was lucky. Whew. I think I read Asus 1 started off as an April Fool's joke. Oh, did it really? Or are they actually doing it? Because now I feel like I've been pranked as well. Emulation jank on it. Finally free from Wall World. Yay! And I called it Wall World on purpose. Want to get Sony New League Portable System? Ugh. These companies doing the cloud-based gaming handhelds? No, that's a ripoff. Just like the Logitech one that they came out with. 
just don't. You don't own anything if you have a device that only does cloud gaming. Like it literally only plays games from a server and what happens when one day that server goes out? You'll never be able to play games on it again. So there's that. They are doing it. Okay, so they literally said, hey, what if we came out with our own? But then they actually went ahead and made their own Steam Deck. Well, I guess it's more of a portable PC than anything because I don't think it runs on its own. Well, I think it runs on Windows, doesn't it? You can mod it, sir. Wait, the Logitech one? That I didn't know if that was the case. Yeah, Sony's coming out with one too, but it only is for cloud gaming or some nonsense, but it's one of those, it connects to your PS5 type of things. So, I mean, I guess. I don't know. I guess I would have limited uses for it. Bring your PS5 with you without bringing your PS5 with you. I really don't like this guy when he does that. I like when he just hits the wall and then does nothing like that. There you go. Yeah, so remote play your PS5, which is kind of what the Vita was supposed to be for the PS4. Um, remote play just never actually... I don't know, it just never really took off. Ooh, this thing doesn't die. Okay, finally, Jeebus. Watching you on the kitchen nest, testing it out. Pretty cool. What's up, Austin? How's it going, man? I don't know, for me personally, cloud gaming, uh, I don't know, guys. I can say that I did use something like that. Oh my god. Uh, with Steam? They have a, uh, where you could, like, remote play your game, your Steam games on any computer in the house, I guess. Which I think is pretty neat. You're basically streaming games that you already own. That's the difference. Oh my god. Jesus, get away from this guy. <laughs> Those things do so much damage, it's not even funny, man. Nope, not even farting around with that guy. Nope. Give you the surprise. Let's see if I can beat this guy. Try to. Much internet. Yeah, it's it's a lot of um your internet has to be able to handle it, and that's the problem I have with um a lot of these uh cloud-based services. So thank you, Duke, for the 51 streak. Week 51 week streak, star send 1001. Hey, nice. this is the king, baby. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I hope Rhino doesn't kill me. I gotta Stay alive long enough where I can start using the acid. So yeah, guys, not a whole lot uh, going on this side. I've actually been playing a little bit of RE4 today and just kind of chilled and hung out for a bit. I'm almost done with the game. I know that when I go back and play it again, New Game Plus is going to make it like an entirely different game. So that's pretty cool. Oh, thank goodness I got him. Woo! Hail to the king, baby. I've got my knife completely maxed out. So it's beast mode. Getting really good at parrying. Maybe one time I'll try to do a professional mode run. I don't know, I doubt it, because I'm not that good at the game, trust me. I can try. But, uh, yo, what's up, my Smega? I think Ryan will be home in about 30 minutes or so. Excuse me, Lurk Lang. One of those weird Thursdays, isn't it? Oh god, that was one of those empty food burps. Oh. Alright, we took out bit, bite, and file will be next. What's up, Andy? 25 more minutes until freedom! Okay, so we got the drill. Technically. Oh no, we can't. Um, we could just go fight this guy. I usually fight him without his weakness. Batman after the 700 club. 
all the conversations that we have, I swear. You call me? What's up, Spencer? Welcome in, dude. The Tiger of Neon. I think they call him Shining Tiger in the Japanese version of it. I think that, that name is more appropriate, but whatever. It's Capcom. Thank you, Andy, for the stars update. This is totally not a song ripped off from Guns N' Roses. No, not at all. What's up, Pedro? Makes sense. I can come here and actually get the uh, upgraded buster. with that guy. So glad those guys can't turn around on you. That would suck. And welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. <sighs> How's it going? Uh, so did X bite bit and zero bit bite or is the other way around? Uh, we destroyed them all both together working as a team because... We're the X team. Yeah, that's it. I'm actually kind of glad that I have X against Neon Tiger because um, X is a lot easier to maneuver than Zero. So. What's up, Paul? How's it going, dude? Welcome to uh, Mega Thursday because I really couldn't think of anything else to play today. I thought about playing Star Fox and Beavis and Butthead on the public stream, and then I was like... Why do I feel like I'm going to get frustrated with Beavis and Butthead? So I was like, let me just uh, make that a VIP stream. What's up? This year, Pascal. Welcome into the stream. Managed to get one crown last night on Fortnite. It was worth it. Lots of Mega Man this week. Now that I think about it. We have uh, X3 today, X4 on Saturday night. And if you guys didn't get the memo, the queen says she'll be doing a Discord hangout Saturday night. So supporters, if you want to hang out, there you go. Why can't they be a team of X and Zero? Why is it just called Mega Man X3? Because it's three times the uh, robots, I guess. Steve, what's up, dude? Looking forward to a four-day weekend. Yay. Off until Saturday? Oh, okay. Is there, wait, wait, wait. Is there a holiday that I'm at? It's Easter. Is it Easter coming up? Is that what's going on? I'm glad you made it, Steve, because uh, I have your gift here. I wanted to wait until you came in before I opened it up on stream. Number one. Number two, uh, I'll be playing your game tonight, sir. I put it in uh, the Discord. What's up, Tom? Welcome in. Ouch. I ran right into him like a ding dong. Take a lot of damage from these guys early on before you get your armor upgrade. Easter's a Sunday, that's why. Okay. Everyone's got the extended weekend. I got it. Yes, 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 yes. I got it. I got it. Oh, I gotta change my weapon here. Wait, do I have uh hold up a game and what I sent? Oh, perfect. Okay, um I don't know what's I don't have the um You don't have Easter off? Dang. All right, let me, um, what am I supposed to use on this guy? Is it the T-Fang, I think? Okay, yeah, T-Fang also works, okay. Oh! Oh! It's gonna kill me. Oh, come on! That's so cheap! No, 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 I will not stand for that. No way. <clears throat> Internet provider and it didn't come back on. Oh no, that is sussy. I'll rewind all this, that's nonsense. I didn't even touch the guy and he's literally just... Here we go. I'm so used to using the race blaster against him, so. What's up, Justin? Am I playing later? Uh, tonight's game is Star Fox and Beavis and Butthead for the Super Nintendo. Got him. Whew. What's up, Doug? Very sussy. So, he got the drills. He would not let me out of, uh, the attack pattern. Alright. 
Okay, no address is shown, so this is the gift right here. In between my battles, I will uh, open it up for you, sir. I just ordered my gaming desk today for the new house. <gasps> Table management. I see so many cool gaming desks that people put together. And it looks like a spaghetti rat's nest behind the desk. And right now, I'll give everyone crap who doesn't organize their cables behind their desk. Because I finally did mine. If I can do mine, you guys can do yours too. So, what's up, Justin? Thank you for the sub renew, man. He didn't know the drill. No, he did not. What's up, Marcus? So let me take out uh, this guy. I still have to decorate this room. You know what's funny is I have an extra friggin' HP monitor that I don't know what to do with. One of those HP Omen gaming monitors, I guess. I don't know. I gotta figure out something with it though. Personally, I don't have any use for it on my desk. Thank you for the light, Ken. Mrs. Blast is like, she's happy with her two on her desk, so. Whoa. You're gonna see a Super Mario Brothers movie tonight? Oh yeah, hope it's good, man. Well, the user scores apparently are loving it, so you're saying F the critics. Guy still have stars to give. 200 stars, let's go! Thank you so much, Ken. Appreciate it, man. I've been slacking on mine since I keep having to redo the kill management at work over I and I over. Still have stars to give. Jesus! Jesus! <laughs> Thank you for the star love, man. I appreciate it. And I did add, well, I still have the other two star alerts, guys. The one random one. And then I have one that's 800 stars as well that I totally paid the price for yesterday. Not telling Pascal the correct amount. <laughs> Damn. I would say between Neon Tiger and Crush Crawfish, that's probably the two hardest Mavericks in this game. And it's because they can dish out so much damage. Not including like the special bosses, like Bit and Bite. That ain't the alert I wanted. Breddy's like, I got you. <laughs> Thank you for the 800, dude. Damn, okay. The Stars Party Challenge has been initiated. Thank you, John, for the other 800 stars. Whoa. Here's my knuckles again. Oh, ouch. <laughs> you mean this one. You mean this one. Duke with a thousand stars. Let's go. Inside a smaller box, okay. Thank you guys for the star love. Why was your stomach yesterday after the toxic waste and hot sauce? It's actually okay. This is pretty small. Da -da 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 -da. Star party achieved! Yo! Who hit the stars party? Oh no, who hit the stars party? Jeez. Yes, that is Leon suplexing a Ganado. Alright, yeah, I gotta open this. I don't have anything sharp on my desk. Urgh. You know how to pack a box here, Steve. I'm gonna have to ask Mrs. Blast for something sharp. I'm gonna make sure I don't show the address here, though. Well, not mine, but Steve's. I don't want to do that. Thank you, guys. Um... I guess you guys can decide, uh, collectively, hot sauce or the uh, toxic waste, because I still have this. Stuff is really good, but it's double packed for safety. Sweet. Okay, okay. Yeah, we got, this is the small box inside of the other the other envelope. I think we needed Brett to finish, so he gets it. All right, Brett, hot sauce, lemon toxic. Oh, shit. All right, let's see if I got it. Somebody might have beaten you to it. Banana blueberry. Black currant. Black cherry. Watermelon. Apple. I have to get Mrs. Blast in here. Precious cargo. Got it. Duke is saying hot sauce. Raspberry. Black cherry. Damn, I don't know where. Ah. Part is for you. Part is for Mrs. Blast. Okay. I need her to come back in here. Mrs. Blast! Can one of you guys page Mrs. Blast in the mod chat? 
lemon toxic. Damn, uh, I'm pretty sure we have another thing of toxic waste in there. <laughs> Wait till she comes back in. And I have to ask her for something sharp to open the top of the box, so. Okay, so, um. We just beat the tiger. Let's go fight a beetle. Yeah. Because technically, I can't get the first ride armor until I beat him and then go to Hornet. Your reaction to my Christmas gift tripped me out. <laughs> Dude, I've freaking tweaked out, man. I was like, this man just gave me a two terabyte NVMe drive, which by the way, works wonderful. I put RE4 on there and the game loads so quickly. <laughs> Insane. What's up, uh, Carrie? Welcome in. Can do watermelon if you don't find lemon. Okay, I'm gonna have her check because I know we have another thing of uh, toxic waste in the uh, in the what we'll call it in the pantry there. No, I have to get that later. What's up, Peter? Welcome in, dude. Go fight a beetle that hops. It doesn't even walk at you. It hops. I don't know where she's at. She's probably um. She just got in from work, so she's probably, like, down-dressing, you know? The game is a classic. I feel like not enough people talk about it, though. They always talk about the first two, and then, of course, X4 on the PlayStation. So it's like, where does X3 fit in? It usually gets lumped in a conversation with X5 and 6 for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, God. Excuse me. Ugh. to change to zero. Sus. All right, next robot I will uh, change to zero. I'm running out of space because I keep downloading moving from headlock streams. Yo, yeah, those things do take up a lot of room, dude. Um, it's, they, they add up over time. Some of them are well over two gigabytes in size, especially if they have like HD textures and all that stuff. Um, yeah, they eat through uh, hard drive space big time. Whoa. I've been slowly filling up everything with Steam games, so there's that. I thought 3 was good. Yeah, I, I like 3. Um, I've owned it a couple times in the past. Um, definitely feel like this game should have never been put on a PlayStation or Saturn. Because Capcom being greedy, because they're just like, oh, we can just put our game on a CD-based console and change the music. And yay, it's a new Mega Man game. It's like, no. Should have just left it for cartridges only, you know? Uh, what's up, John? Welcome in. Them are, yeah, for a fan-made fighting game, yes, that is actually a lot of space that they take up. All right, let's, uh, where is it? There you go, Race Blaster. X3 is very underrated. X3 Sega Saturn prices. <laughs> Mega Man 8 Saturn prices. Mega Man X4 Saturn prices. Out of control. Is this X3? It is, yes. This is the Super Nintendo version of it. But, you guys can get mad at Capcom for re-releasing their old games on everything. But because they re-released, you know, they released the X Legacy Collection, you're able to play this on your Nintendo Switch on modern hardware. And the game plays just fine, so what's up, Cesar? It is super expensive. That's why I highly recommend you pick up the X, uh, the X Legacy Collection. Does a lot of damage if uh, you let them hang out too long. Might play Time Crisis. Wait, Time Crisis? You mean Virtual Cop? Yeah, they did. They actually made. Uh... See, I can never recommend that collection anymore because Capcom, for some reason, they only included the CD based version of X3. I think it was the PlayStation version of it. Um. Not everybody likes that music. They'd rather play... And the sound effects are different, too, from this version. I took it way back with this game. I haven't played this game in a while, believe it or not. Have you played Final Fantasy 1 through 6 because Pixel Remaster is coming out very soon? Oh, really? No, I have not played 1 through 6. I'm a FF7 whore. I can't help it. Chris, welcome into the stream. Hello, hello. Okay, so, uh, we took out the beetle. Now we get to go after the hornet. 
We're gonna sting. <laughs> Can I find this game? Uh, FF7 is more rated. If you want to play X3, you can always play uh, the Mega Man X Legacy Collection. That's on the Switch, PC, Xbox, PS4. Definitely play that officially if you'd like to. And usually it's really cheap. So if you have any of those consoles, or if you're going way back, you can play the... Uh, Mega Man X Collection for the PS2 or GameCube. I highly recommend the PS2 version, though. But that controller is way better suited for these games. Rather than uh, the, the uh, GameCube controller. Is this one of the better sequels? Um, This version of it is, yes. Damn, man, I'm just getting hit by everything. X2 is one of my favorites. 1, 2, and 4 are some of my favorites. I don't... This is not a bad game, though, by any stretch. People just like to lump it in with 5 and 6 for some reason. I don't know why, but... It felt sort of like a rushed game. It only came out like a year after X2 did. So... M7 is greatest RPG? No. I never thought that ever. I always knew that there was better RPGs out there. I don't know where Mrs. Blast is, guys. She's, I don't know, I'll have to figure out. Otherwise, I would have had her here by now to give me something sharp to open the package. Yeah, you think they're going to make a Marvelous Capcom 4? Mm, I mean, we technically got it. Unfortunately, NBC Infinite ended on a really low note because of Disney. It's Disney's fault. Capcom had dumped so much money into that game, they just didn't want to give up the project and cancel it. In fact, all the money that was in that game was because of Capcom. So, X7 is better than 3. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, you did not just say that. No freaking way. Yeah, I think there's just too much uh, business beef between Disney and Marvel. Or Disney and Capcom, rather. MCU VC, not MVC. <laughs> that is an ugly game, man. Oh, you can tell Capcom got to a point where they're just like, well, we're not dumping any more money into this and we absolutely need to. We're going to monetize the crap out of this game and make sure we try to make some money back. To be honest, the last um, MVC game was Ultimate MVC 3. Two was the best. UMBC3 was the last one, though, but 2 was the absolute best. And I still have a legitimate copy of that on my Xbox 360 to this day that I bought on uh, back when Xbox Live Arcade was a thing. A pick of a Super Nintendo and Genesis controller with American flag and background. Proud veteran of the 90s console war. That's me, too, man. Absolutely. You're always trying to find ways to prove to your buddies which was better. But really, it didn't matter. It was just something to talk about, you know? Each game had turds. Each game had really good games, or each console had really good games. It just depends on what you wanted to play more of, Mario or Sonic, really. There's a trailer for NBC4 on YouTube about to watch it. Nah, uh You're joshing me right now. Marvel Super Heroes is better. Wait, like, the, the fighting game? Marvel Super Heroes, mean that one? Killer Instinct, one of my favorites. I just got into that game, dude, uh, a couple months ago. I never played it as a kid. So, I didn't know anything about combo system or anything. So, I've, I've learned the game, essentially. When you guys were playing back in 94, 95, I only started playing in 2023. So, I bought the... Well, I bought the game twice. I bought it for Xbox One. I bought it for PC, and I have the arcade versions on my computer and on Xbox One as well. The Return of Heroes trailer for PS5? No way. 
It's not an April Fool's joke, is it? Just trolling me a little bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where's Mrs. Glass? I haven't seen her at all. Is that the stream? I don't know. What's she doing? Waiting so I can see if we have any lemon toxic waste left. And I need a knife to cut this box open. What's up, Jose? Welcome into the stream. We're all gamers. It doesn't matter what platform you use. Exactly. What's up, Cal? Welcome in. Good job, Zero. You did it. You got the parasitic bomb. Pretty useless weapon, to be honest. I mean, it's, it's good against Buffalo. That's about it. 11 stars. Let's go. 20 week streak. Holy oh, yeah. You guys an idea how many times I've beaten this game. One, one, two, three, four, five, five files here. Six. This is my seventh run of this game. I really like this game. Lemon. I know I'm waiting. Okay, so we got the robot suit. So now we can go back here and actually... Oh, I could have done that before because I had the drill already. Damn. Video was posted 2022. So it sounds like a fan game. I thought there was way too much uh, business beef between uh, Disney and Capcom. But then again, you've got those arcade one-up machines that have NBC 1 and 2 or whatever. Or they have the other Marvel games on them. X5, X3. I have a fan fixed version of X5. It's actually not bad. At its core, it's still Mega Man X5. Hello, Queen. I need two things from you. Jesse, what's up, dude? Welcome in. I need something sharp to cut open this box for Steve. And then I also need a lemon toxic waste if we have any. I need it rotten. Oh, I beat it last time without the gold armor and stuff. Okay, that's cool. Queen is here. She needs to come here. We need the stuff I asked for. Do, do, do. Um, and then technically, we can go here. Yeah, let's go get uh, that other chip that's here, too. What's up, Edmo? Disney can literally print money if they acquire the rights to those Marvel arcade games. I know. So I think what I'll do, Star Fox, I'll probably do like, I'll do a full hour. I can beat the game twice, I think, in that hour, by the way. Eat what you have. You don't need a knife to open the mail. There is a full tab. No, you don't understand. There's a box inside the envelope he sent that is taped very securely. And I need something to open it. It's got tape on it. And they requested a lemon toxic waste. So I need to know if we have any. Got cleaned up. I'm relaxing at the moment. Wow, you're gonna really make me get up in the middle of the stream and go get it myself. You have to do the butthead voice the whole time playing the game. Are you effing serious? <laughs> I'll see what I can do. I can try. I can't watch Beavis and Butthead anymore. Loved it as a kid, but Beavis. I guess uh, I'll get up myself and get it. So let me finish this part, guys. Hold on. We'll grab the toxic waste and the knife. Get the chip. Get can't get the gold armor. No, no, no. That the this one is for the mech suit. I guess. Hold on, please. Uh, he did. He packed it extra secure. Tina's putting her foot down. She can. That's fine. I mean, I'll I'll get up and get it. I think it's. to float to the top here. I forgot they made a new show for that. Game Serial. You're the milk without you. Game doesn't seem right. You're a vital part of this community. Keep growing. Going and growing. Happy streaming. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Although sometimes I think I'm water added to the cereal. Although I feel like some of you guys here have actually had cereal with water in it. How was I being rude? I told you I'd get up and get it myself. It's not a big deal, but you insisted on getting up and... I didn't know where you were because Princess is still in here laying in her bed, but you were in the room. Okay, so... We're good, we're good. Uh, catfish? Let's go get catfished. I'm sure this game has a pause button. It does! I was gonna get up and get it, but... I think I hear stomping on the way here. Cereal with water, never had it. 
Beavis and the dumpster fire was a funny episode. I, I've never had it with water. Ever. I'm super amused. <laughs> it's a daily thing, man. Whoa, that was close. Oh, I have to fight Vile here. I don't know about that. Should I fight him with zero? Whoa, thank you. Whoa! I told her I would go get this myself. What was the aftermath? It'll come on the 11th or the 12th. Cool! Super knife. Gotta be very careful here. That's struggle food. You should be glad. <laughs> I thought powdered milk was struggle food. I right, gotta be careful here. Speaking of catfish, I gotta put one up. I gotta put up with one more fish on Friday. Uh oh. This knife is. I gotta sharpen my knives. I need a knife sharpener. What's up, Jason? Okay. I love this knife, by the way. This thing is awesome. Powdered milk. Ugh. Yo, this is like a box inside of a box here. <laughs> easy, easy. I'm gonna get this box open very carefully. Oh, it's our Warhammer pieces. Duper duper extra secure. Now that is some precision painting, dude. That's awesome. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, now that's pretty cool, actually. Hold on. So some of you guys know that Steve actually paints really small models, like Warhammer stuff. And this is the blue and yellow one. That looks like a Zaku. It's actually pretty cool. So there's this one. And then there's this one that's red and yellow. Struggling food is king vitamin cereal. Blech. Oh God, that stuff is nasty. There's the red and yellow. It looks just like Zero. It looks like a Zaku. It's actually pretty cool. I have Warhammer Vermintide. I know it's not the same type of game, though. That's actually really cool. Thank you, man. I remember you showing these off. Thank you. These will go nicely on the shelf, sir. And I better put these back in the box because I don't want to lose them. I have to decorate this room so badly. Thank you for the gift, Steve. I appreciate it, man. It's like pee. That's all I know. I know Vermintide is not, like, usual uh, Warhammer. Very nice. All right. Secured in the box. And now, because Breddy is a sadist, yellow. King Vitamin was the ish, and it got me through many a night. Don't you badmouth King Vitamin. Ugh. It's all my grandmother used to buy. It's all she'd ever buy. She'd only ever buy freaking King Vitamin cereal. I hated it. Yay! Lemon. Why, Bruddy? Why? Alright, let's go fight Vile with Lemon. Ugh. They were fun. That's awesome, man. I can never precision paint like that. Mm -mm. I do not have a steady hand. Oh god, run! Murph cereal? I never had that as a kid. Oh. Man, lemon is terrible. Oh. I am the hype. I'm glad I didn't have some hot sauce yesterday. Oh. Mm. Okay. All right. I'm good. This three on 360 Dark Tide just came out. Oh, it's basically all crunch berries? Oh, okay. I'll be all right with that. We actually have, um, check cereal. You bought cinnamon and then cinnamon, apple cinnamon. It's actually good cereal. Damn it. File, you piece of crap. Ugh. The lemon super soda flavor candy is rough. I gotta try, I gotta find that. What's up, Andrew? Ugh. 
What's up, Gilmar? Oh, the nuclear fusion lasts a lot longer, but it's not any better, man. Definitely will kick the crap out of you. Oh, you shiz. Damn it. So blue marines for me, red marine is for the queen. Got it. I gotta get this room decorated. I need picture frames so bad. Damn, they're expensive though. Poster frames on stuff? So Amazon, Walmart, and Target all carry it. Oh, okay. If you love me a good Amazon run, though. Amazon's dangerous for me. I think Amazon's dangerous for a lot of you guys. Amazon makes you buy shit that you never think you ever need. So there's that. Uh -oh. God, I gotta place and download it. What's up, Magno? Oh my god! Try not to fudge around. Got him. Woo! Just said I don't want to fight him later, so. Like a bidet, exactly. <laughs> Amazon's dangerous as a nerd, yeah. I loved honeycomb cereal back in the day. I collected the points. You know what Elder Cereal used to like is uh, corn pops. And nowadays, uh, I don't even think they make that cereal anymore, do they? The mascot is Nightmare Fuel. Do they still make honeycomb? It's like a milk sponge, um, having those things. Hello, Mr. Daniel Bogomenza. Uh. Got it. Got it. I don't care about that. What's up, Anthony? Yeah, I gotta get more nuclear fusion. They still make it. I read somewhere that they're not making corn pops anymore, though. These companies gotta cut corn or somewhere, you know? Run! What's up, Christian? Thank you guys for hitting the like. Don't forget, if you haven't, make sure you do hit that like button. If you're considering even remotely of liking this content. Make sure you follow the page as well. Captain Crunch, aka Dentist Appointment. Oh! Roof, uh, roof Mouth Destroyer. But I do love the All Berries one. I don't know if they make that anymore, though. What's up, Brian? Not touching that. I think that guy killed me last time I went through here. Damn. What's up, Tommy? So I was hearing some uh, issues that some streamers were having today, guys. They couldn't go live. And I'm glad uh, we didn't have that issue today. <laughs> I've been so pissed. They're like, no. And it literally just says, you've been temporarily banned from going live. It's like, what the? Oh, what's up, Jay the Pouse Man? I like the peanut butter crunch. Isn't that, does it taste like um, the Reese's peanut butter candy or Reese's peanut butter cereal? Jesus, that was close. That one makes me nervous. Gotta have my pops. Oh, you punk, you shot me in the Kona. I haven't seen any, uh, I haven't seen any corn pops lately. See, I think they did cancel that cereal then. Your pebbles is meant, just fruity rice krispies, sir. Sir, you leave Fruity Pebbles out of this and Cocoa Pebbles. They're all, both amazing. Very amazing. Way easier to do that part with X, or up zero, I mean. Double jump, FTW. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Some of those cereals I, I would, I used to eat like, Whatever. What's up, Clyde? I'd literally just have the box and just eat the cereal out of the box without milk or anything. Cereal is very dangerous. <laughs> that stuff, man. Mm -mm. Yes, that's sugar. That's sugar. Pretty Pebbles ice cream sandwiches. There's awesome. I've never had those before. Damn, that does sound good. Damn. I'm tripping. Come on, all this kind of junk food and stuff. have that stuff. Can't have too much of it anyway. Uh, let's use the kangaroo armor. You don't get it. Ow, damn. Sounds 
I'm sussy. <laughs> sounds delicious. I've never had it before, but it does sound good, though. The only way you can use that armor is right here. in my family we take cereal we make cereal ice cream sandwiches oh damn think about that the only type of ice cream we really ever have is the, the gelato because it's just uh i don't know you don't feel like kakaduki after eating it even though it does have a lot of sugar in it i don't know what's up donkeys i miss the old tricks with the fruit shapes and the old lucky charms with the plain four leaf clovers oh yeah they've changed it all way too much to like cookie crisp but it was not what i expected yeah your your taste buds change like what once every seven years so what tasted okay back then is way different nowadays what's up dunks how's it going man daniel welcome in thanks for the like ah, i'm gonna be sus now See that the Z Saber does like nothing to him. Gotta get him down to like half health. There we go. Get the T Fang on him. Oh my god! Once he starts doing this, you can't hit him with anything other than this, so. Same old, same old, he says. You ever tried sea salt ice cream with cookie dough? Uh, so the gelato, they make a sea salt caramel. That one's actually really good. Thank you, Mrs. Blast, for the stars update. I apologize if I came off as rude asking for lemon sour candy and a knife. You cut open a box. I apologize to you. I'm saying it in front of everybody. I don't want it to be like, yo, I'm sorry after the stream. Say it now. I didn't know you were. Oh God, it's doing the second round of sour crap. Ugh. See that guys, I'm being humble. Oh dear Lord. Ugh. <laughs> She's like, did he really just do that? In front of everybody? Ugh. Oh, that was awful. Yeah. All right, so we gotta go back to... He said, uh-huh. <laughs> All right, uh, we gotta go back to Tunnel Rhino because we can get the helmet upgrade. I'm trying to think off the top of my head, where is the armor upgrade? Oh, we can go here too. Let's go to Beetle. Let's go get the heart tank in here. Oh, I already have the armor upgrade. Sweet. Yeah. If you guys have never seen it, uh, Koto Bukia makes really awesome Mega Man X uh, model kits that you can put together. They're super easy snap togethers. They're not cheap, but uh, the kits are freaking sweet, though. They look like full size action figures. Ah, oh, you what a sucker. Oh, come on, you little shizzes. Stop it, you're nonsense, really? Thank you. Lemons in your eyes. <laughs> Let's keep it even. Magna Streams, thank you for the likes. Welcome in. All right. Did that. Next. Helmet upgrade is here in the, the Rhino Tunnels. You guys ever have like the month of your birthday and you're just like I don't really know what I want to do or what I want. What's up David? That, that's kind of like the issue I'm having right now. It's so weird. I'm in a weird spot in my life right now. I don't know. Like she asked me like what I want for even for dinner. 
for my birthday and I'm like, I don't really know. Usually I'm just like, oh, I want this like right away. Don't know. I know I want a cake at least. I want a red velvet cake. That's about it. Your birthday is in one week. Is it really? Oh crap, it is. <laughs> Literally next Thursday is my birthday. Ew, my birthday's on a Thursday. God, ugh. I have pure citric acid coming tomorrow is what makes things sour. Why would you do that to yourself? Are you trying to give yourself ulcers? Like, it was just like one of those, yeah, I mean, I, if I want really anything for my birthday, like, I want a PS5, but it's like, what the hell am I gonna do with that? Like, seriously. This will be here with me. I don't know what the hell I'm gonna play. I don't know what I'm gonna, I don't know. Damn it, time, stop moving so fast. I know, seriously. Crazy. Oh god, that's that's a citric acid burp right there. For your sake, ready. I hope you don't have any problems. Coworker sent me earlier two picks. One is a Zelda Twilight Princess canvas, and the other one is a X4 jigsaw puzzle I did a while ago. I'll post them in the video game section. Dude, that's awesome. Yeah, I want to see that. I didn't even know they made jigsaw puzzles for uh for Mega Man. I will, don't worry about it like that. I just meant you so would remember. <laughs> find uh, the helmet upgrade, which is brought here. This guy right here. Pure citric acid. Why would you do that to yourself? I'm just thinking about that. That's got to be painful. You crazy, Bretty. I got to see what I have planned for next Thursday, too, as far as a uh, subscriber game. Um, next Thursday is... Oh, nothing. I purposely did that. Okay, good. So I'll play something. I don't know. What's up, Tavares? Thank goodness. That's not painful at all. People go all the time. Oh, no. No, you're crazy. Too crazy, man. What's the benefit of it? That's what I want to know. Hello, Andy. Welcome back. I'm curious what the benefit is, is of having that, like consuming it directly, you know? Play MGS3 for your birthday? <laughs> I wouldn't get very far though, that's the thing. Um, I think for me, part of the journey, well, a big chunk of the journey for X for, uh, MGS3 is um, the, uh, the dialogue and stuff. It'd be a tough game to play. I am the hype! Test your sour limit. Good lord, sir. That's it? Pride and glory? All right, sign me up. I do want to try that super soda thing you're talking about. Oh, here's the map it gives you. No, not the drill. Jeez. What's up, Tom? Welcome back. Ijects. Indian Jex. Sounds like a TV show. The last ones. Right, my favorite one is the Hawk Armor, and I only get to use it once in this whole game. It's right here. That's it. They should have gave Leon a mech suit to use in RE4. Let's go balls to the wall with it. Why not? Absolutely need it right there for that to get the last heart tank. Yeah. I need to. S oh, I can't. Hold on. Now I can switch to zero. Sounds like a 90s cartoon mascot. <laughs> kind of does, doesn't it? Dinner time. Isn't today like super easy dinner? I couldn't even use it all the way. I had to like stop right here. Sus. Like fries and something else. Something delicious. Can't stress it enough, guys. Don't forget 
subscribers. Please don't forget Sunday at 3 p.m. when we do the subscriber stream. I want to play that uh, golf game on the Switch, the mini golf game. I'd like to get a full room if possible. It supports up to 12 players, so post them on Discord soon. I can't wait. Like I said, I never knew they made puzzles like that for Mega Man. I wish Shadow Armor was in a better game. Yeah. Why did it have to be X6? Like, even trying to play the fan fix version of X6, it's... At its core, it's still Mega Man X6. It's, it's still a really, really half-baked product on the official level. And uh, there's nothing we can do about it. So... Finds them on Amazon. Oh, okay. That'd be cool, though. I'm always a big fan of, like, getting jigsaw puzzles and framing them. I think it looks really cool. You get the puzzle glue and stuff like that and make it look like just one big photo. Oh, that one hurt big time. What's up, Craig? Damn, this guy. Damn. Ugh. Classic Mega Man game that is copyrighted. At least it wasn't X7, that's true. Uh, the last time happened at Edmo was X6. Homemade chicken wings and air fryer, fries, saute, broccoli. Yes! I don't know if I'll... Oh, shiz, I'm already zero, so I can't switch. Yeah, it was X, X6. I remember uh, a few years ago, it was actually uh, Mega Man 7 that used to get people. Mega Man 2, 5, and 7 used to get people copyrighted back in the day. It was crazy. He's being like extra not sussy. Oh, God! Never mind. Like Mega Man 2, 5, and 7. Oh, Jesus. Uh, it would literally just get you copyrighted instantly on the X series. Back in the day, none of them. Last one that did it to me was uh, six, though. You don't you dare. Yeah, this guy, he hits hard, man. For a shrimp, you hit hard, sir. Dude's a crawfish. You just fought a robotic catfish. I know. Two foods that they actually eat in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> Dip fries and milkshake. No. I bought before I got home on eShop card to be able to buy the golf game. Yay. Now I want to see this uh, puzzle Pascal was talking about. Whoa. That's awesome. Okay. That's pretty epic cool. It's literally the cover of X4. And Twilight Princess. That's pretty cool. No, not the X series. He's talking about OG. Mega Man 2, 5, and 7 used to get people copyrighted. But I, I personally have never been copyrighted on 1 through 11 on Mega Man. So. What's up, Q? How's it going, man? eShop has some interesting... Oh, interesting. That's the word we're going with, Freddy, is interesting. I had no idea that interesting was the word we were going to use for uh, the Nintendo eShop. <laughs> I don't understand why the eShop is the way it is. Hit this month's goal. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Did you just initiate a food challenge? No, you didn't. She just initiated a food challenge. She just said that if we hit this month's goal on my birthday month, that my punishment would have to be to dip fries in a milkshake. Did I miss the I missed the memo on that? The it's why? Why did I? Oh shit! I should probably X this. We're gonna get the gold armor and Zero's uh, black armor as well. I am the hype. Is the my birthday team. Oh, for real, dude! Happy birthday, man! Y'all need to drop some cake in the chat for Mr. J, the boss man. Hell yeah, dude! 
I'm one week from today, actually. I'm feeling old already, man. Oh, he hitting the goal. <laughs> Seriously? Is that where we're going with this? Yeah, exactly. That's literally the uh, reaction I got from it. What's up, Brendan? There's that birthday cake. How about if we hit the star goal, Mrs. Blast has to eat tuna fish. How about that? She'd be like, hell no, nah, I'm not doing that. That's disgusting. <laughs> That's what she's going to tell me. <laughs> All right, Zero. Hold up the wall for us or the ceiling from collapsing. <laughs> AKA stand in the corner. Yeah, exactly. Damn, seriously? Is that what we're going to do? I was thinking like ghost ramen challenge, ghost pepper ramen challenge. I go with fries and milkshake. I'm going to buy the Wendy's fry and shake. It's not a shake. It's a frosty. No ifs, ands, or peaches about it. Nope, this is blast processing, not Queen Jack's. All right, I'll initiate the challenge the next time you stream on Saturday morning. How about that? How about that? Should we make the, uh... Oh, Jesus. Yes, thank you. Should we make May's challenge then? Or, or May? Yeah, May. Not June. Tuna fish sandwich with ketchup. Oh, that's disgusting. No. No, 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 no. The queen will not be trifled with tuna fish, sir. <laughs> Maybe she will. Yeah, get out of here. You wouldn't dare. Watch me. Golden chip. Here we go. So I guess that's my challenge because the queen just. Bit, 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 bit. You guys hit the goal. I guess I'll puke on stream, dipping fries in a in a frosty. Mayo and salad, then Adam. No, I would never do that because that's a that's a British thing. But I don't know if they actually use mayonnaise though. Do they use mayonnaise or salad cream? Is there a difference? Chicken salad's way better than tuna, though. I'll eat both. I don't like potato salad. You can tuna piano, but you can't tuna fish. I can tune it to my liking as far as food goes. I'm gonna like it. Golden armor activated. So I just realized this spike ball thing here falling, that is literally in Resident Evil 4 Remake. This thing right here. In the castle, there's the one section where you're running up the tower to get to Salazar, and one of the Ganados starts pulling the lever, and it's spike balls falling. So it's salty sweet. I was gonna have a reply to that, but I'm not gonna do that. I don't like potato salad either. It's facts. I've always noticed that. I've never noticed it. Well, this this part right here, um, they didn't put the spiky ball until the remake. Oh, you punk. They had the flaming barrels like Donkey Kong style when you ran up the staircase. Oh, it's the junk robot. Ah. Potato salad on a picnic and it might appear if you say, show me potato salad. <laughs> I'd rather have macaroni salad. I'm more of a macaroni salad guy. Don't break the nose. Seriously? Break the nose and the whole floor will get flooded with acid. Oh, come on. Don't break the nose. There you go. There you go. Sweet. Don't skip credits already for me to make. That's all I'm saying. Oh, no, I wouldn't anyway. Why don't you break the nose? Because if you break the nose, uh, it'll flood the, the bottom of the stage with acid. Because if you notice, he drops little acid at you, and it looks like a... You know. <laughs> but if you open it up, it'll just flood the room with acid. Anyone got at least 190,000 or 290,000 stars? 
Oh, no. Well, I guess, Mrs. Blast, you can initiate the challenge in Discord, then. I'm not thrilled about it, because I really, truly do not like... I've been saying it for years. I don't like uh, Frosties and Fries mixed together. I don't understand the... Um, the like why people do it, because it's really, really terrible. Uh, you know, Tommy, I was, I was going to go there, but then I was like, I'm going to take the high road on this one, man. Couldn't do it. Oh, they always do that, man. They are they are content recyclers all day. So now we have Shadow Armor Zero and Golden Armor X. It's good to have them like that. Like I said, I'm getting pretty close to the end of the game, Brady. I've got I got to fight Krauser. Um, yo, what's up, Josh? I um. I did the part where Sadler took Ashley away for the umpteenth time. And she tried to turn the gun on Leon and his gun jammed. So she got lucky, or he got lucky actually. And I'm about to go through that cave right before I fight uh, Krauser. No, we don't, no, no, no. No, don't do it, don't do it. You guys will probably laugh at me during that whole challenge. Thank you, Monsieur, for the 51 stars. It's better than fruitcake, that's true. Um, I don't think anything can match the disgustingness of fruitcake, though. Like, fruitcake is on a whole other level of, holy God, who eats this, you know? Oh, you know what? If I switch to zero and I walk in here, <clears throat> he'll take him out. Hi, Kells. Hope you're doing okay today. I don't believe Jedi Survivor will be 150 gigs on consoles. Oh, PC will be way more, dude. No, I think PC will be about the same, if not a little bit less. Oh, damn. Because of all your ray tracings and stuff. I hope Capcom does a fix really soon for uh, ray tracing on RE4 because um, I'm sick of my game crashing in the middle of playing it. What's up, John? Daniel eats it. That's who. I know, but... He has poor judgment and food taste. He doesn't like chocolate. But he won't eat a uh, chocolate-covered fruitcake, though. So, you know. Which one's this, Carlos is asking? This is X3. But it's a fan game called The Zero Project. Monsieur made it evens, I bet. He did. Well, he made it, uh, what does the queen call it? Supreme Evenly. Thank you, Carlos. Appreciate the like. You know, I'm just thinking about it. I don't ever recall playing Beavis and Butthead on the Super Nintendo. I'm pretty sure I played it on the Genesis and the Game Gear. Weird as that sounds. What's up, John? I love Mega Man. This looks dope. Yeah, man. It's X3. It's called Mega Man X3 The Zero Project. What's up, Aaron? Fan-made version. Well, fan-created? Fan-fixed version of this game? Play a zero through the entire game if you want. But if he dies, you know how that goes. There are some situations where Mega Man is just better. Whoa! Whoa! Thank you, Edmo, for the 77 Sonic Falling Stars. <laughs> Thank you. game that no one ever talks about. It's always about part one, part two, part four, seven. I feel like we talk about X7 more than we talk about X3. Just throwing it out there. Yeah. X is better, yo. I can tell you right now, D4 will be 110 gigs and Jedi Survivor will be over 100. It's already 150 on consoles, apparently. Perfect. Well, let's get zero in here. I don't think his uh, health fills up. He gets a longer health bar than Mega Man does also. Which is pretty cool. It's to make up for the lack of armor that he doesn't have. Sonic unalived in that star alert. Yeah. 
But it's from 2006, so I don't really care. No one likes Sonic 06. Nobody. It's no use! Take this! Oh, silver. Oh, Jesus. You don't see any of this outside of the eight Mavericks? Really? People would say that this is the most difficult. This is one of the more difficult ones, too. <sighs> they nerfed his uh, Z Saber a lot, just so he could be playable throughout the game, you know? Normally, you can't fight bosses as uh, Zero. I'm not really sure why we got third hedgehog in the form of silver. It's weird. Much less a fan-made version. Well, the only thing they changed was, well, it has an actual save system. Um, and you can use zero throughout the entire game. And he gets his, his black armor as well, which is pretty cool. Technically, that armor was not introduced until X4, so they kind of retconned it in their own way, so... The only reason why I'm okay with Silver the Hedgehog is because he's voiced by Quentin Flynn. And if you don't know who Quentin Flynn is, if you've ever played Metal Gear Solid, he is the voice of Raiden. Oh, I can't be S. So I gotta fight all the Mavericks as Zero. What's up, Marcos? Have you ever played Sweet Home? I have not. I've actually never played that before. Lord Zed is a ranger now. He looks dope as hell. Oh, super corrupted, huh? Was it X2? Officially, though. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. So, I totally forgot about X2 having hit. The only reason why is because I always saw as the black or gray armor zero. He's like a carbon copy of the real red zero. I never thought of him as a threat. Because every time you go to fight him... X or Zero just blasts him with three shots and he's done. So I just thought he was just a cheap copy. Like, they had the blueprints, but they didn't, like, know how to actually make Zero. Oh, shiz. Silver sussy. <laughs> I only like him because he's voiced by Quentin Flynn. That's just me, though. And because he plays as Raiden in Metal Gear, so... Yeah, he runs a lot faster and dashes a lot faster too, guys. So when you're Black Armor Zero. There he goes. Pink Ranger's super OP in the comics. Is it because she's full of anger? Who's the Ranger Slayer? What's up, Ashley? Welcome in. Pinko, thank you for the likes. Way too many hedgehogs, I agree. Bom, bom, bom. Alternate Pink Ranger is the Ranger Slayer. Oh, okay. So she's... Is it still Kimberly? Bom, bom, bom. Okay, okay. Ugh. I couldn't use the Z-Saber. Get off me! What a suckers! Yeah, take that. Oh, damn. That didn't really do much to him. Craziest T-Ball schedule. 17 games they start next weekend. Holy crap! the pink ranger who works for lord dracon oh okay so it definitely has to be uh it's gotta be um it's gotta be kimberly then mnt vs street fighter 5 issue comic series comes out next month that's gonna be good oh okay now i think i can use uh where is it there it is gravity well what's up mike Ooh. you know what that's actually good that you guys set him up 
or um, T-Ball, actually, gets him out of the house and he can start exercising his brain a bit instead of, like, always wanting to be in front of the TV or tablet or computer or something like that. So, good on you guys. Is this included in the Mega Man X package on Xbox? Um, it is, but not this version, Aaron. Uh, this is called uh, Mega Man X3 The Zero Project. But you can't play this version on there. This is a fan-made version of it. However, if you have like a Super Nintendo Mini, or if you run an emulator on your computer, you can definitely play it on that though. This is the version that Capcom should have given us. I got lazy. What's up, Rodrigo? I know what you guys are thinking. Capcom? Lazy? Never. But it's true. I promise you. Yeah, man, no problem. Ah, hit him with this. Yeah, that's, that was the exact reason for it. Keep his little body healthy, but 17 games. Last one is June 2nd. So busy. Good. And you know what? If you think about it, it does something good for you guys as well. It gets you guys up and out. And I know you go to work every day and stuff like that, but it helps you break the monotony of just getting up, taking care of the kids, taking care of the pets. I mean kids as pets as well. Getting their food ready, getting your lunch ready, getting dressed, going to work, working all day, coming home, cooking dinner. Checking on Carson, going to put him down, put him in a bath, getting him dressed, pajamas, go to bed, wake up. You know what I'm trying to say? It breaks the monotony for you guys as well. X3 is a lazy incarnate. <laughs> it's not that bad, sir. Too crazy, man. So it makes your schedule a little bit hectic, which is good. Come on, hit him with it, damn it. have seen my travel baseball season for one summer 60 games see bc bc it's like his own little machine gun i can't wait to do new game plus on re4 it's gonna be awesome i'm just gonna plow down all the villagers with every weapon that i have i don't know if i actually want to use the unlimited rocket launcher apparently it uh knocks your rating down immediately your ranking rather i'm golf with mine ducks but you're you're trying it out too daniel did you pick up the game so i watch you play it though <laughs> because you're good at mega man he's definitely needed shake up and he loves t-ball already chris wants him to play in the mlb there you go starts with you guys so absolutely i've only played one course in that mini golf game uh daniel it was the the haunted house i think it's a fun game. I didn't realize you could press the A button to make the ball jump in the air when you, when you hit it. That's not including tournaments. See? Yeah. Whoa. Come here, you little punk. And he's had a long day, but guess what, man? You got a long weekend. Hell yeah. Damn, he almost got me. Is it only on Switch? It's on uh, Switch and PC. I think it's on everything, but it's not crossplay though. Because I would have bought it for $5 on Steam if it was crossplay. What's up, Adam? Welcome in, dude. I played baseball from 3 to 18 years old. Sir, that was like a year ago that you were 18, right? <laughs> Boy, my back is killing me. He is having con to us, I suppose. Every time he, I go to buy an item, that's all he says. Drives me nuts. I don't know. Like, I understand everyone's like, oh, why do they have to remake RE4? And it was a great game, but there were some things that they did better in the remake. I was actually okay with the fact you didn't have to run from that stupid statue. They've got rid of all the QTE events. I'm totally down with that. Get the run with you didn't have to do um, the minecart section was redone, and I really, really like that version of it better than the, than the old one. So the underground caverns way better than the new one. 
it's just crazy they took a game that essentially was a perfect action shooter, action survival horror, and just made it better. It really needed an update in the controls, and they did it perfectly, so. Uh, politics and travel base boss is not a whole lot. What game are you talking about? Sorry, I was too busy hunting survivors on Dragon Ball The Breakers. Um, depends. We were talking about Resi 4 Remake. I know that. Total revamp. It's so good, dude. It's so good. Capcom got me to buy the game for like the fourth time. So. But if Freddy plays with y'all, then I will play too. Well, there you go. That's the spirit. What am I doing? This is not the right weapon. Off tomorrow. I work on Saturday though. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. What's up, Blake? Damn it. It's a lot of fun though. I will say that for sure. There was some parts of the castle that they changed a lot and I was totally down for it, but it still kept the essence of the Salazar castle. So the regenerators are actually more terrifying than they were in the original. <laughs> They're in bullet sponges. So until you get the, uh, the IR scope or they call it the bio sensor scope or whatever, they will chew through bullets like nobody's business. Don't even bother using a handgun on them. Got him. Friend of mine said, Vector Man is derivative of Mega Man. Now I think of that every time I play or watch someone play Mega Man. Yeah, I could see that being a thing, yeah. Vector Man was purely made in the West, so... Um, yeah, maybe they wanted their own version of a Mega Man game for the Genesis. What's up, Bill? Can I be a duck in the game? Uh, I believe you can actually decorate your golf ball with a duck bill on it in that game. Salazar is your right hand comes off. Must be fun at the party. So there's an achievement that you get if you beat the Verdugo, which is the, the big alien looking thing that chases you underground. Uh, the achievement you get is something about your right hand or something like that. So they kind of do a little callback to the original. So I'm totally down with that, how they did that. is no vector man yeah vector man is a very difficult game I actually found a uh, comic zone very difficult too it's a fun game but god damn that game is hard too but i understand why it's super short so but it's actually very good it's called uh golf with your friends it should, it's on the eShop right now. Hold on, where is it? There it is. Uh, yeah, it's, yeah, golf with your friends. If you want just the base game, it's like six bucks to get the Bounce House Castle or Bounce House Castle DLC, I think it's called. It's two bucks more. So for like seven or eight bucks, you get the full game. Much respect. Blake, thank you for the 500 stars. My dude, thank you, man. Oh, yeah. Everybody needs a little gas money every once in a while. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Let's go. We got to fight uh, Dr. Doppler here. I think so. It has a totally different vibe to it. Vector Man has more of a 3D style versus Mega Man. Maybe just the running gun. That's about it. I think um, just the running gun parts. He jumps totally different from Mega Man. It's definitely... Uh, different from Mega Man, but I can see where they got the inspiration from, so I totally get that. Yo, what's up, Chris? Thank you for the 11 stars, man. Keeping it odd, my man. We're gonna fight Doppler and not refill his health. Now, I should go to a different stage, swap to Mega Man, then go to the Doppler stage. I'd rather fight... I'd rather fight uh, Sigma as X and not Zero. He said, I'm here! You made it, man. You made it. There's a lot of story to this game, too. It's weird. It's a Mega Man game. Does it really have to go that deep? <laughs> Can't hit this guy. What's up, Eli? You gotta wait till he does this and goes through you. Even then. 
What's up, Clayton? Six, eight, nine. So if I shoot him now, I'll put up his little green shield. And I could use acid on him, but I'd rather just do it this way. As long as you don't shoot him when he's facing you, like when he does that, if you shoot him, he will literally refill his health. Yeah, you gotta be really careful. And that does not work on him. Whoa. Sound like a sus boss, yeah. Buster no saber. So the saber doesn't even work on him. I'm sorry, Joshi. I literally, on a whim, decided to play this today. Oh, see, he refills some of his health. Piece of crap. I might switch to the acid here in a minute. Enemies took damage if they were hit by the exhaust of the boost jump. See, I never knew that. Never knew that. That is a game I played when I was a kid, though. I used to rent it. Um, Comic Zone, on the other hand, I never actually rented that as a kid. I knew it existed. I just never played it until uh, one of you guys, or somebody had asked for I think it was Peter who asked for it on a subscriber stream a while back. I blame ShopRite. They needed their best employee there. That's why. That's why. He's going to be like, I guess so. <laughs> Ah, I see. Never had. It's fun but difficult. Yeah. I use the cheat codes to help me through the game because I've noticed, and I don't know if it's something I just did wrong, but there's actually a part in one of the levels that if you don't have rewinds or save states, you can actually uh, soft lock yourself if you're using the invincibility cheat code. And uh, yeah, I was able to get out of that room because of the save states and rewinds and retroarch. It's like high grade Pokemon. <laughs> Supreme victory. Comic Zone was my first rage quit game. I don't blame you, man. The game is hard as hell. <laughs> oh, realsies. Doing this the long ways. Why? Because why not? I'm not saying old people have a smell, but Dr. Doppler looks like he would have a musty smell about him. <laughs> In his beard or his, uh, his like mohawk thing he's got going on. I can assure you my mohawk smells wonderful. That's what it was. I was getting too close to hit him with it. All right. There we go. Maybe his lab smells like doctor's office. He is a doctor. Yeah, see, they even added extra dialogue, too. What's up, Rob? Welcome in. I created a horrific new body for him. Wait, is he Unicron? Creating bodies for people? It's in the underground hangar of this lab. I don't think Sigma has occupied it yet. Don't worry about me. Destroy the body before it is too late. He gonna die. Time's running out. You can only assume that he actually um, I am the stays in the lab when it explodes. X and Zero versus Unicron. <gasps> I smell the chicken cooking. Show me potato salad. I need to switch. I'm going to go to a stage because you can't switch characters in Dr. Doppler's lab, so... I'll switch to X, and then I'll exit, and then I'll go fight him. Zero had a lot of screen time just now, so... 
Now let's go fight him. A lot easier with X. I don't feel like having any struggle juice today, so... It's crazy, unless you can find the original source code <laughs> or, uh, for, for, or Sigma, you can never actually kill him. He'll always be alive because he's a computer virus. It's called Mega Man X, not Mega Man Zero. Exactly. Go do the grunt work, Zero. But let me stand still and fill up my health real quick. This is um, X3, Chris. But it's a fan-made version called the Zero Project. I struggled really hard the last time I played uh, this game as Zero and X without their armor upgrades because this version of Sigma is a nightmare without the upgrades. Wouldn't have succeeded if it weren't for you meddling kids. <laughs> Yeah, he does like twice the damage. What's up, Luis? Like a zero has no protective armor. Can't take maybe but five hits, six hits from him. You burn through your freaking uh, sub tanks as well. He throws the Captain America shield at you too. Take it with Roms to make a fan made Vector Man 3. I mean, they're, the second one is pretty much the same exact thing with different levels. I'm sure there's uh, fan versions of Vector Man out there somewhere. Like, even if they change levels and stuff like that. Maybe make like an unofficial Vector Man 3. That'd be pretty cool. Captain Sigma. I always look like him as he's like Batman with a Captain America shield. And then now he's just a big chonk boy right here at the same time. He's just X's body just blown up. With bigger legs and all that. Oh yeah. Those actually do a lot of damage too. Mothballs. <laughs> well, the, he's talking about if there was like a fan version of it. What's up, Mark? He's like a tiny head, <laughs> a giant body. That's what I'm saying. Un unofficial Vector Man 3. Yeah. There's gotta be. Have you ever checked um, romhacking.net? There's gotta be rom hacks of Vector Man. Daniel says he sucks at golf. <laughs> Don't feel bad, man. I've only played like 20 minutes of the game, so, and I was like, oh, this will be fun with supporters. Too similar to Halo, so it was scrap. Oh, yeah, I forgot that beam does that. Yeah, check out romhacking.net, dude. There's gotta be something there for Vector, man. I mean, hell, I found a rom hack of X Men for the Genesis there, and it's awesome. They fixed the game, they made it playable. I'm totally happy about because I actually like that X-Men game. It's just too damn hard. You know Daniel's never going to go to London, right? He'd never drive to London. Need a new Mario Baseball? When was the last one that came out? For the Wii? See? It, okay, I'm not going crazy. Yeah, it's literally X's body. Those missiles. When you're zero, you take so much more damage. At least double what X does. And those missiles are no freaking joke, man. GameCube, okay. Clone Wars. No, the first one. The first X-Men game. I think there might be a ROM hack for X-Men 2, but the first one. It's amazing. Yeah, the kitchen smells really good. I don't know why. I'm to defeat you with this magnificent buddy. This magnificent buddy. Oh, God. What's up, Phil? You made it to the last part of the part one stream, sir. Doggy Sparkin. After this stream, we're gonna 
boot up uh, Star Fox. Oh god. Star Fox and Beavis and Butthead. That should be interesting. <laughs> Get away from me! I'm so glad the lava doesn't insta kill you. Because that would sack. I uh, literally just smudged my own glasses. Hold on, guys. My gamer glasses actually do make a difference, believe it or not. Damn, it's dead end. Why do I got Mega Man swearing in this game? Right. Only ever played the second. The first one felt way too clunky. So I guess the hack fixes that issue big time. You actually regain your health. Your X powers don't take away. It's just, it's just a much better experience. Work meetings keep me busy. There's a ROM for X-Men Clone Wars, really? Or ROM hack for it? Daniel would never go to London. He always says it. It's very sussy. I infused my Z Saber with the Sigma vaccine. So you open the Blast Marines and play Star Fox. Dude, I actually like Star Fox. I love that game. It was one of the few games I played as a kid that I loved finishing it on every difficulty. My program is disappearing until I come back in Mega Man X4. Yo, kids, I'm gonna get you. Wow. The one time that I'm actually still live in the algorithm, guys, and it's past an hour and a half. Facebook, you tripping right now. I wonder if it'll go past two hours, though. Don't forget, if you guys have not hit the like button, I'd appreciate it if you could. It's a free way to help support the page. If you, if you like this type of content, make sure you follow us as well. Curses foiled again until the next game. And the game after that, and the game after that, and the game after that, and the game after that. Even if he is a zombie in Mega Man X6. Thank you, Adam. Appreciate the like, man. We each have the best name ever, by the way. Just want to tell you that. What if I hit the heart button? Hearts are good, too. Hit the hearts. I'm going to keep refreshing this until it hits two hours, and I'll see if my page is still live in the algo. I've been seeing uh, FB streamers going to kick and twitch more and more. Yeah, a lot of people are moving over, man. Um, as crazy as it is, I may be insane for saying this, but um, I'm sticking with this, man. I, uh, I have my own little plan set in place right now, but I'm staying put right now. I've got, for me personally, um, uh, I've been hitting my goals and things like that and things I want to do on the platform, so I am where I am. That we do. <laughs> Why won't you die? Thanks, Daniel in London. He ain't going to be happy with that. There's absolutely nothing wrong with diversifying your content, though, for real. I'm right there with you, Phil. But that's something we can talk about on the substream if you guys want. <laughs> Plan on staying put, but I'm being pressured to go to Twitch or Kick. By who, Steve? I'm just telling you to go over there. You gotta make your own decisions, man. If you think it's good for you, if you, if you wanna experiment, you can totally do that, man. But uh, as another streamer has said, if it's a sinking ship, I'll be there till the end. So, my missus. Try it, dude. I mean, the problem is, and I'm just, I'm not going to go too deep into this subject on a public stream, but on a sub stream, I will. But there's awesome comic shop in London. <laughs> um, like 95% of the streams on kick are, they're not gaming related. They are for Fortnite, maybe Fortnite, maybe Warzone. But a lot of it is, of course, the gambling stuff, the uh, hardcore nudity streams type of thing, that's on there still. I don't care what video game I play, I cannot compete with porn adult content being streamed. I just can't. So this is not going to happen. <laughs> so, watching Wakanda Forever, was Namor more anti-hero than Venom? Than Venom? Than villain? Yes. I like Namor. Nothing wrong with having backup plans, though, in case things go fits up here, but it still needs a lot of work over there at Kick for Donos. Yeah. You train a little in X4? Should I train? 
Are you gonna are you getting better, Pascal? No dash canceling. Actually I haven't played X4 since um I don't know what day was it? Been a while. What's up, Daryl? Like I said, me, I if I go anywhere, it would maybe be re YouTube. Because, like, I've asked you guys before, like, all the supporters, like, yeah, I have a YouTube account. Like, it's almost like if you're on social media a lot, you're just on your computer, on your phone a lot, who doesn't have a YouTube account, you know? You think people want, but be diverse in what you do. I learned that with my shirt printing art project thing. See? It's all up here. No dash canceling. It's cheating. What's up, Brian? So when Pascal and I have our Mega Man X4 race on Saturday night... The one rule is no dash canceling. I got an ace in my sleep, but I won't tell you. Oh! oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. He has an ace in the hole. Guess I'll have to wait and see. Yeah, I have same thoughts on kick. Yeah, I just... I, I can't compete with that, guys. Uh, at the very least, Facebook does not allow those types of streams. I mean, on the broad scale. I know stuff slips by and we they've had their issues in the past with, you know, not so cool abiding streams on here, but you will never, ever see that on a public live stream here. So YouTube for how to basic. <laughs> I wish they'd come back with videos, man. I really do. Yamor was a badass. The vibranium staff was a nice touch too. I think he looks better than in the comics. I think he does too, man. Uh, he was very plain and very... Um, just generic looking like oh we have a we have an underwater superhero that's what he looks like he looks blah but in the movie he looks awesome though you gotta do what you think is right man if you want to try it out go for it if not you're just like you know what uh i think having one social media page is enough for me um but there's absolutely nothing wrong with diversifying i will never tell someone to not go somewhere i'll never shame somebody for going somewhere else to try something new um that's just not me so g units i'll never even consider watching kick streams imagine if capcom made another x game and x sees his past self and roll and rush that'd be cool like a multiversal Mega Man game where's x corrupted where is the game Church. I'm waiting to see what happens at two hours. We have like a minute left on this. I like being part-time. That's it, man. And you know what? It works for your schedule. You stream when you can, and that's it, you know? You're not trying to, uh, you know, go out of your way. And I mean, you absolutely could if you wanted to. You could absolutely just go and make another page and do your thing, you know? But... This game actually has a new game plus, by the way. Check this out. I got to show you guys this. You want to acknowledge that GoBots are the best? No. No. You know what I say to GoBots? No bots. All right. Let me just pick any one of these. The ending is kind of a remake of X1. Yes. You look more Mayan than Atlantean, which is good. He is. Oh, wait. No, it's not what I wanted. Hold on, guys. Let me rewind here. What's up, Tyler? Let me see if I can, uh... I'm trying to get the clock pass in two hours, see if my page stays live in the algorithm. Actually, H, restart? Yeah, there it is. I'm gonna try that. I did a new game plus on this, where you actually have all the Mavericks. You can actually just fight them with all the powers you already have. It's pretty cool. We're gonna see if that still works. Oh, that's why. Okay. What's up, Michael? This should be it right here, I think. It's actually a clear file. Yeah. Sweet. We're going to try this. See how this goes. <laughs> how you doing today, Michael? Look, you start with your armor already. That's pretty cool. I never thought I'd see the day where they'd let us do this. 
thank goodness for the fan community because Capcom would never allow us to do it like this. It's funny because this is already an easy game as it is for me. It's like, oh, here's all your weapons and everything else to go with it. <laughs> Hope you're doing good. Yeah, the boss is tougher. I don't think so. I think it's all the same. They literally just get beat up with their own weaknesses. But I can try, though. I'll get to a boss, see what happens here. We just went past two hours on OBS clocks. Let's see. That was my time limit. My time limit was two hours, guys. Let's finish this stage real quick. And uh, here, let's show you the weapons. Yeah, look. Everything's here. Let's finish this stage real fast, and then uh, I'll take my little break. I'll grab. I'm gonna grab some dinner, and this is blast been making dinner. So, and then we'll do the sub stream after that, guys. So, if you guys uh, want to see different, diverse con content, games I normally wouldn't stream, become a page subscriber, pick up that green badge. We also have access to a Discord. Which is freaking awesome. Post stuff in there all the time. So, thank you, Queen, for the likes. This is Blasting the Marines. She hasn't yet. I gotta show her to, I gotta show her them. Oh. Come on, Mac. Mac, he's in the game. He's right there. Come on, you little punk. Jeez. Really? It is pretty cool being able to play this with all my stuff. Whenever you know already know we'll watch. That's very true. Like I have my loyal fan base, which I'm very, 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 very appreciative of. But uh like for the sub streams, I can play other games that I normally wouldn't play and tag. And it doesn't hurt my overall average. So that's how I look at it. Like Fortnite. I can't compete with the big Fortnite pages. Um I love playing the game. I just can't compete with my algorithm does not play nice. My page doesn't play nice with that tag, so I played on substreams. Resident Evil 4 Remake. Uh, I've never been the biggest Resident Evil streamer, but being able to play it on stream and hang out with you guys and you can do the jump scares and all that stuff like that to me, that just that's awesome, you know? So do I have Wi-Fi internet back? No! Are you from me? Adam? I see how it is. You enjoy it too, man? I'm almost done with the game. I can't wait to finish it. I'm going to try to finish it tomorrow, but there's, I think there's quite a bit of content left on it, so. Alright, guys. That is it. We are done. We got cut off at two hours, which, you know, I'm happy for. Um, I appreciate that. Thank you, Facebook, for cutting me off at two hours. <laughs> oh, it actually still uh, let me do it. Okay, guys. So, we're going to hand the top star to Breddy. <gasps> Breddy, you're the top star. That's freaking awesome. All right, sweet. Yo, what's up, Chris? You made it to the last two minutes of the stream. I'm gonna go get some dinner. I got my ass kicked in RE4. I'm ready to finish it up and replay it. Me too, man. I'm re I'm, I'm Jones of that new game plus. So yeah, guys, uh, supporters, I'll be on ASAP. I'm gonna have some dinner with Mrs. Blast. See how her day went. I haven't talked to her at all, really, except for texting at work, but I haven't seen her all day. So We've got Star Fox and Beavis and Butthead coming up in a few minutes. So make sure you guys tune in for that. Subscribers, um, everyone else, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern. And uh, you guys have a great rest of the evening. And uh, subscribers, I'll see you guys soon. Freddy's the top star. We got you, Ming. Thank you guys so much. And I'll see you on the next stream. Peace out! Bruh.